Black Monday warning snow turns to deadly ice as temperatures plummet to minus 15 C overnight. The temperatures are expected to be coldest in parts of Wales and the East Midlands. The forecasts have come after yesterday's snowfall and high winds led to cancelled flights, delayed trains, and motorway closures. The Met Office has also issued further warnings for snow and ice across Scotland this morning with a separate ice alert in the south. Forecaster Illa Clayton said, We are expecting a really cold start to the week especially where snow has settled. Temperatures tonight could get back down to 12 C in parts. Chief Forecaster Steve Ramsdale warned people to take extra care on frozen roads and pavements today. Mr Ramsdale said, some injuries are possible from falls on icy surfaces and there will probably be some icy patches on untreated roads and cycle paths. Yesterday brought the first significant snowfall to many parts of the country since January 2013. The biggest fall was in Senny Bridge in Wales where over a foot fell. This was followed by Hereford with 7 inches and High Wycombe in Buckinghamshire with almost the same. Meanwhile, rain showers fell across southern Britain with London. Kent and Essex getting a soaking. The West Country was also hit with 90 miles per hour winds. Thousands of people were also left stranded on roads yesterday as snow and ice caused disruption across the UK. The A and RAC dealt with more than 21,000 breakdowns on Sunday as the severe weather tormented the nation. AA President Edmund King said they received a 40% increase in callouts. Motorists were forced to abandon their cars on the M40 motorway, the A34 in Oxfordshire, and the A5 in Milton Keynes according to the Thames Valley Police. The heavy snowstorm on Sunday even caused an 11-car pileup on a motorway near Durham at around 8 p.m. The Rack Motoring Organization is expecting 11,000 car breakdowns today, which is 20% above the seasonal norm. After a brief mild spell midweek, Bitter winds from the North Pole will blast back by the weekend, experts warned. Arctic conditions threaten to hold out through the festive period prompting bookies to slash white Christmas odds.